everyone welcome to my channel if you are new and welcome back if you're returning um today is paycheck number three of january and i have four hundred dollars here so let's go ahead and get on in to my cash stuffing so i have 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 50 60 70 80 93 10 20 30 40 55 65 75 85 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, and 400. So I am going to put this in my cash tray now. Okay, so as you can see, it's a little bit different setup. I got this new thing right here. It's pretty cool. It um, has my computer on the top of it. If y'all have seen um, Baddies and Budgets, she has one of these, and I got it. I got the idea from her, basically. So, yeah, I love it. It makes my desk look so much more organized. I do have a lot less room to, like, work, but it makes my desk so much more organized and... So yeah, that's why it looks a little different. So first we're going to do the unstuffing of my wallet. And I have already taken out my change. So let's go ahead and do my change counter. So I got to take this off the way. Okay, so it has 1476 And I just put it in this other, um, this cup right here because it fills up my wallet little pouch. So I just put it in there like at the end of every day. So here we go. I'm going to speed it up. Alright, so we are at 16.06 now. I am going to do my wallet here. So gas has nothing in it. Food has a bunch of ones, I believe. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. I'm going to put that in the back of my cash tray. And spending, I didn't use spending at all, but I still have the 10, put that behind my 50 here. And then we don't count blessings, and I have nothing but a sticky note in my bank envelope. And I do have to scan these receipts in here. If y'all haven't already heard about Fetch, um, Fetch is an app where you scan your receipts and you get points. And I will leave my code up on the screen. I always have it in the description down below if you use that code you will have 2,000 points with your first scan and it'll also give me 2,000 points. So it's a win-win for both of us. <laughs> okay, I'm put that back. So I have those ones in the back and this little tin here that I'm going to put that in mine. Sorry if y'all hear some noise. My cat is playing with his toy. <laughs> okay, so first we are... Why did I... Yeah... I don't know why I zipped that up. There we go. Okay. So first we're going to do gas. And gas gets normally 40. I wonder if I could stick this up under there. I think I can. Yay. Okay. So gas gets $40. And I just used two 20s. And I didn't go to class but one time this week. So I'm going to have to test out next week. Um how going to all of my classes drains my um, gas. So I can see if I need to put in extra or what. So next is food and food gets 50 and I just do two 20s and a 10. So 20, 40, and 50 going into food. 
All right, and spending is getting $10 this time as well. And the reason I have been doing good with spending is because I've been actually wanting to save it up. <laughs> so that's why it's been in there. So Blessings is going to get another five this week. And I do not count this. And that is it for my wallet. To my bills binder and that's this brown binder here and I do have all my binders up on top of this thing so that's why I will be grabbing like this <laughs> okay so I wonder if this is okay I'm just gonna bend it like I normally do okay so first is vet and vets gonna get $10 and that's 20, 30, 40 in vet, and that will actually com complete it for the 2nd of February because it's $38, but I just put 40 in there and so that it grows up my um, buffer little by little, a couple dollars. <laughs> Next is car payment, and car payment always gets up. I took a 10 from the wrong spot, so I'm going to just put it right there. But actually, I think I'm going to put it behind these ones so that, nope. I'll put it right there. Maybe I won't grab it again. Okay. So next is car payment, and car payment is getting 61. So that is 20, 40, 60, and one dollar. And it now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And so that is the payment for the 5th of February. It's actually $2.42, so I have a couple dollars extra in there too. Which I'm going to go ahead and put that in my buffer because I want to bring it up a little bit. I keep hitting the um, tripod here, so I'm so sorry if y'all keep on moving. Okay. So I did pay my water bill. And I kept it in there this time just in case I need it. So after this water bill payment, the, after February's water bill payment, I will take out the extra because I'll probably have a lot extra. So water bill always gets 18. So 10, 15, 16, 17, and 18. So... That is 10, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36 dollars. So how has y'all's weekend been? Leave me a comment and let me know what y'all do on y'all's weekend. Did y'all have like a chill weekend or did y'all go places? I would really like to know. And Geico is getting 25. In February, I might be bumping this up just so I can actually make sure I meet that goal of 1600 So I have 1000 1, 2, 53, 20, 45, 50. So $1,350. Because I do need to make sure that I have that by March. And that is it for my bills. I love this binder for some reason. It just looks so cute and I don't know. <laughs> My cat. What are you doing? I'm being loud. Alright. So now we're going to go into my savings and high priority sinking funds. So first is savings. And it gets this normal $20. I give it $20 every week. Excuse me, I have the hiccups. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 20, 40, 60, 81, 2, 3. 983 
almost 2,000 in savings. That is so cool. All right, next is emergency. And I did hit my 1,000 goal for my emergency fund, but I am still going to be adding into there. So this time I am adding a five. So we have 110, 15. One thousand ten fifteen. One thousand and fifteen dollars. <laughs> Not used to these thousand slips being in here. And these thousand slips are in here. In case you don't know, I put them in here because I don't want that money all in my house. So I go ahead and put it into my bank account, savings account, and um, put this little slip in here so I can know how much is in there without having to check my bank every single time. So... This is one month ahead, and one month ahead is almost done, so it is getting a 50, and I think this should complete the $1,200 for the one month ahead. So I have 1,000, 50, 100, 20, 45, 46, 47, 48. Oh, I was wrong. So I still need over $50. So that did not complete it. I will hopefully complete it next week or the week after that. And that is okay. Now we're going into my high priority sinking funds. And first is gifts. And gifts is getting $10. So gifts has 20, 35, 45, 50, 51, 52. It has $52 in it. And this is good. I don't think I have, I don't think I have anybody's birthday in February. So I should just keep building it up in February. And then in March I have my brother's birthday. I have my niece's birthday. And then I also have a wedding to go to in March. So I will need to figure out what to buy there. I don't know. What do you get? What do you, leave a comment telling me what's a good gift. For like a wedding like I have no idea this is the first like real wedding I've been to I've been to like backyard weddings <clears throat> but I was also younger so I didn't really buy the gift my the person who went with me bought the gift so like my parent or somebody so I have no idea so just let me know because this is my first wedding like since I've had a job <laughs> so medical is getting five dollars So, medical has 150, 65, 66, 67, 68, 168, and I actually need to be paying that medical bill I have soon, so I can't remember, I think it's 160 something, so it will be draining my whole thing. <laughs> Hopefully I don't go to the doctor very soon. Okay, so next is car maintenance, and this is a weird one, but I always feel like car maintenance has to have something does anybody else feel like that <clears throat> it has to have something going into it because i'm always scared my car is going to break down even though i have a newer car and it's in good condition so it's getting one dollar <laughs> so car maintenance has 100 250 70 80 one two and 83 dollars 283 <laughs> Just makes me feel better if I'm putting something in it every single week. <laughs> All right. And next is pets. And pets is getting $3. And I did take my cat back to the vet for his checkup. Um, and um, the last time I took him to the vet, he had to get on a steroid pill to make his, um, he had these scratches where he was scratching himself too hard on his ears and his lip. So the steroid pill is making that heal up faster. So they um, just wanted me to come in a week later to see how he was doing on that. And so I did go again and this time it was only like $48. So I went ahead and took that out of here. So I don't have as much in here anymore. So Pets is getting $3. So one, two, and $3. So Pets has 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 
which is good if I need to get them food or anything like that. That is pretty good. Now we are going to go into my low priority sinking fund. Oh, that did not want to come off of there. <clears throat> All right. And we have beauty and beauty is getting $1 as well. As you know, I'm trying to save up $20 to pay back my car maintenance fund since I did use the $20 that I had in my wallet from the car maintenance fund to tip the lady who did my nails. Well, the lady, two ladies, the one that did my toes and the one that did my nails. So, <clears throat> this is clothing and clothing is getting nothing this week. It has $151. And I am actually going to probably be buying a dress with this money soon to go to that wedding. I just don't know what the dress code is yet. <laughs> so I'm waiting on that. Alright, events. Events is getting its normal $10 for this event. So we have 50, 100, 20, 30, 40, 50. So 150, we are almost done with this event. Need 50 more dollars till then so 150 for that and I am also putting in five dollars no not five dollars I'm tripping on that twenty dollars and this is going towards the wedding because it is I have to drive two hours away so it's just going I'm separating it right now by this little index card I have in there so that's twenty dollars for a wedding event and 150 for my Justin Bieber concert. Next is health, and health is getting skipped. It still has its $50 in there, which I have to go buy um, some stuff and use this soon. So it will be going down, and I'll have to stuff that. Vacation is getting nothing. It's getting skipped, and it has $55 in it. Next is Eric, and Eric is getting a $5 bill. <clears throat> So Eric now has five, ten, and fifteen dollars in this envelope. And then me, I get what was left over in my spending envelope. So that is this ten dollars here. And I just had to use it to pay myself back for some stuff. So it now has twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, five, fifty six, fifty seven, fifty seven dollars in my envelope. That's crazy how it went from 127 to now I have 57. <laughs> I used it pretty fast, huh? Next is wedding. And wedding is getting its $2. I'm going to move this up. The wedding is getting us two dollars. Did this come out of here? I hope so. I think I wrote down 80, 98, so let's see. 50, 60, 70, 50, 70, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Y'all, where did this two dollars just come from? Did it come out of here? <laughs> Okay, I just watched it back and I think it came out of here. If it didn't, we'll come back to that. <laughs> okay. So, we have in wedding 50, 70, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, and 100. And y'all, that's just from putting $2 in there. I'm not even engaged yet. I'm not even in expecting an engagement right now, and I have $100 saved up for my wedding, my future wedding. That's so crazy, isn't it? Next is future, and I will explain this because I haven't explained it in a while. So this is for anything that comes up in the future in my life that I have. I don't have a sinking fund, and... Um, I like need the money for it so that's what future is so future gets two dollars as well so it future has 50 75 
50, 60, 70, 80. Uh, what is wrong with me, y'all? 50, 70, 1, 2, 3, and 74 dollars. Next is Retire. And Retire is getting $2 as well. And yep, that's where that came from. Glad that worked out. So, Retire has 50, 61, 2, 3, and $64. Alright, and I'm going to start saving up for Christmas because I should have started at the beginning of January, but that is alright. I'm putting in a $5 bill here. So Christmas is starting off with five dollars, and that is it for this binder here. Okay. So now we are going to go into my savings challenges, and that is what this money here is for. So I'm going to slide that back up in there because we don't need it. And I'm going to get my $1 savings challenge and we're going to go ahead and do that one first. If y'all haven't seen this already, I got this jar, just the jar from Target dollar section. It was $5 and then I put the label on there myself with my Cricut Joy. So we are putting in the jar. One, two three, four, five, six, seven dollars this week. And the reason that I have to like keep switching things around and because I can't go right here because this is too close to the camera, but uh, the tripod is like right here in front of me. <laughs> so that is why I do that. Okay. Again, don't know why I roll it up. It unfolds anyways. Should just stuff it in there, but it's okay. So that is how much we got in my one dollar savings so far this year. Super excited about that. So I forgot my envelope challenge, so I need to get that. It's right here, this little box. My mom got it as like a little treat gift box tower, and it had some more of these, but smaller, so that is why these little marks are on there. That is okay, it is still cute. So, as you can see, I have four tens here, $40. So, what I wanted to do this week is pick uh, random numbers below 10 because I have already done 10. So, these, I want to pick four random numbers in these, and I'm putting 10 in every single one of them. So, that is what I wanted to do. So, I'm closing my eyes. I want to pick this one, one, this one, two. This one, three, and I'll pick the back, so four. All right, so I picked nine, two, seven, and five. Put them in order. So the first one is two, so we're gonna put a 10 in two. And the reason I'm doing that is because I don't wanna have a whole bunch of ones to count. So the lower numbers I am putting in tens for every single lower number than 10. And I put 11 into number 10. If y'all missed that one. And I noticed that I, this is number 5. I noticed that I have been forgetting to color in my savings trackers with y'all. So I'm going to also try to remember to do that. I don't know why these are sticking so bad. going to take them out so that I can color them in 
really fast with y'all because I haven't been bring my little handy dandy um, notebook in here <laughs> okay so we are gonna go out and go to my savings challenges and I did fill this out before this is my emergency fund challenge um, and here is the 100 envelope challenge and I am deciding to do this in purple so I have 46 let's find 46 and if you are wondering where I got this temple from I actually made it in my um, in this good notes um, app right here I made it Let's see if I can oh well it's okay <laughs> so 46 32 with good notes if you wanted to like not go over the black parts then you have to use a little highlighter if that's a little tip for y'all next is 10 I already did 10 because I knew I did it 100 I already did 100 down here because I knew I did it and 30 oh. I'm doing these coloring ends what is y'all's um, favorite challenge that y'all have ever done I think this is a good one I um, like the Christmas in 12 weeks challenge which is what I have like right here and it was pretty easy I did it last year with um, just my rollover money. Okay, so this is all we have done so far. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten done in the first month of January. I'm so excited about that, which I just remembered I need to color that in. Because I just put a 50 in there, so I do have only two left. <clears throat> well, actually I have one and some change left. So I'm gonna just leave that there. <laughs> I'm gonna put these back up in here. Behind the little thingy right there. So this is how much I have left to go. 90 left to go since I've done 10. <laughs> Alright, so that is it for today's video. I hope y'all liked it. If y'all did, leave me a like and comment. If you have made it to the end, leave this emoji right here. And just so I can know who's watching it till the end. And um, also subscribe if you would like to. If you would like to join the family and you like the videos that I make. Also I have an Instagram if you would like to check that out. It is at Caitlin Marie Budgets. Just like my name here on YouTube. And I do post reminders up on there. But that is it. Thank y'all so much for watching. I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.